Good morning. I'm Janelle Burrell with your morning digital news brief for this Friday, June 4th. Bricks from a building in Old City, Philadelphia, crashed onto the sidewalk overnight. That partial collapse on Market Street also damaged a car and a sign, but nobody was hurt. Officials are blaming it on the rain that fell heavily across the region yesterday. Three Wilmington police officers continue their recovery after they were shot during a standoff. Investigators say Bernard Goodwin shot those officers when they responded to a domestic dispute call at an apartment complex on Market Street. Police say Goodwin later took his own life. And the Phillies are playing ball again at full capacity at Citizens Bank Park starting tonight. You don't need to wear a mask everywhere in the ballpark, just in the indoor areas. Also today, New Jersey is lifting all indoor gathering and capacity limits. And now for our forecast, it's going to be a hot and steamy weekend to head, Larissa. <laughs> yes, it is, Janelle. We're tracking temperatures in the 90s as we approach the weekend. Humidity is not going to budge. We'll get there in a moment. I'm going to start us off with today because today we have another threat of a round of strong to severe storms. Right now, the threat is marginal and it does encompass all of New Jersey, all of South Jersey, all of Delaware, and parts of Pennsylvania as well. We're talking Delaware and Philadelphia counties to be specific. Now these are your temperatures this afternoon. 80 degrees here in Philly, 71 down the shore, around 72 degrees up in the Poconos. Now the severe weather threat, as I mentioned, marginal. It's not going to be widespread or as active as it was yesterday. Strong winds still a possibility here with any one of those stronger storms and heavy rain can lead to areas of flash flooding and then once the system departs, oh boy, Janelle, we are heating things up with highs in the 80s down the shore and highs well into the 90s here in the city. All right, Larissa, thank you. And remember, you can always get Larissa's most up to date forecast and the latest stories right here on CBSPhilly.com. That is the latest for the morning digital brief. I'm Janelle Burrell. Have a great weekend.